your friends gather round, gather round. It's your old pal Timber the Tail Spinner here to regale you with some of the most hilarious and exaggerated tales from the forest. Now these stories might be a bit stretched, but that's what makes them so much fun. So sit back, relax, and let your imagination run wild. about the time I tried to outsmart the wise old owl. You see, this owl was known for its riddles and puzzles, and everyone who could solve them would be granted a wish. So being the curious beaver I am, I decided to give it a shot. I climbed up to the owl's perch and said, Wise old owl, I have come to solve your riddle. The owl hooted and presented me with the trickiest riddle I've ever heard. I scratched my head and chewed on a twig, and finally, after I felt like hours, I cracked the code. The wise old owl was so impressed he granted me a wish. And what did I wish for? A never-ending supply of the juiciest, crunchiest twigs in the forest. Now that's what I call a beaver's dream come true. Next up, we have the tale of the singing frog, the willow pond. These frogs were just any frogs. They had the most beautiful voices in the entire forest. Every night, they would put on a concert that would make even the grumpiest badger smile. But one day, a mischievous raccoon named Ricky decided that he wanted to join the choir. Only problem? Ricky couldn't carry a tune to save his life. The frogs, being the kind hearted critters they are, decided to teach Ricky how to sing. After many hilarious attempts and a lot of patience, Ricky finally found his voice. And after that day on, the concerts at Willow Pond were more magical than ever. Ah, but let me tell you about the and when the tallest tree in the forest decided it wanted to touch the star. Yes, you heard me right. Old Grandfather Pine, as we called him, grew so tall that he could tickle the clouds. Grandfather Pine grew and grew until one day his topmost branches brushed against the star. The forest animals were in awe and they all gathered round to see this miraculous say that on a clear night you can still see the stars twinkling in his brain. Well, my friends, I hope you enjoyed these funny and exaggerated tales from the forest. Remember, the best stories are the ones that make you laugh and let your imagination soar. Until next time, keep dreaming, keep laughing, and keep spinning those tales. This is Timber the Tail Spinner, signing off. See you soon.